everybody, thanks for watching. This is our Pittsburgh brand 1500 pound capacity vehicle dollies sold through Harbor Freight. This is a set of two, two piece set down in the bottom. And as of November 2022, this will run you around $65 when they are in stock. I've got two sets of these and I've never used them before, so this will be my first time review. I have a small car in back, maybe weighs 1800 pounds, specifically a Geo Metro that I bought for parts. I'm going to push that out of the garage to put my nice Geo Metro, yes, those words go together, my nice Geo Metro in for winter storage. And I need to do this today because tomorrow is wintry mix. Let's put this on QuickTime and I'll open it up. Pretty nice set. These weigh, the package weighs I think around 35 pounds. Can't find it, so I'll put the number down below at the bottom of the screen. But what I didn't realize they had, which is kind of neat, is a handle that will fold out of the way once the wheels are in place. You get four heavy duty caster wheels with it and a set of hardware to fasten them on. Pretty solid half inch looking bolts there, maybe five eighths, probably five eighths now that I think about it. And the casters appear to have locks on it. Yeah, it looks like on and off. Of course that makes sense. So I'm gonna put this together again fast time and uh, we'll try it out. Pretty neat design. I like the diamond plate look, although it is kind of a battleship gray. Uh, not chrome, but you know what? I'm not that vain. I just want to move a car in any direction in that tight garage. About as easy as you can get for installation. You just have a washer, a spring washer, and then the acorn nut. Uh, these are, I think, 11 sixteenths. No, they're three quarters. So you need a three quarters wrench uh, to get those through and uh, hand tighten it. And the acorn will squish the spring washer and you're good to go. Um, moves together real, moves really nice. Uh, pretty heavy duty wheels. Um, I'm gonna do this three more times off the camera and we'll go try them out on that car. Here's what we're gonna move. This is an old Metro XFI. I bought it specifically for parts for my other Metros. Uh, this can be stored outside over the winter. Of course, we'll roll up the windows, cover up the missing window, and put a nice car cover over it. But being in the elements won't be a bad thing. Um, but I've got it wedged in here, and this is an ideal application for these car dollies. I will jack this up, put the wheels on, and push it out. And then I'll have enough room to put my little silver one in here that'll be all protected from winter's fury. Okay, I've got two cameras going, one time lapse and one real time. We're gonna push this thing outside so I can get the good geo in covered storage for the winter. The car dollies performed flawlessly. Pushing around a garage on a hard floor, no big deal. Pushing it around on a asphalt, no big deal. So all in all, these things performed exactly how I wanted them. And once I take this off these, I'll put it on blocks for the winter and cover it up. I'll be able to use this to move my other three, actually I'll have four geos in this garage, move them around if I need to effectively just by scooting them around like pieces of a, like a puck on ice. So I recommend these. I wish I would have bought them years ago. I think $130 or so, maybe $140 with tax. This is the Harbor Freight Pittsburgh 1500 pound dolly. If you want to learn more about it, I'll stick a link down in the description below, or perhaps you can go there and buy one for yourself.
That's it. Thanks for watching.